bed, Rocco. Good elephant. I just got to clean your bottom teeth and then we're going to be done. And I'll just get some more. <gasps> I'm out of elephant's toothpaste. Stay right there. Reuben, I'm out, of, I'm out of elephant's toothpaste. We need to make some more so I can clean the rest of his teeth. Quick, no how way, do we do it? Mate. How do we do it? OK, well, we're going to need a couple Stay of chemicals. Yep, yep. Uh, we need some hydrogen peroxide. Yep. We need a little bit of detergent. Yep. And a catalyst called uh, potassium iodide. Hydrogen peroxide? Yes. Isn't that what they use to bleach your hair? Yeah, that's the weak stuff. We're going to use the industrial strength, though. Oh, OK, right. Now, okay. I should point out that we're not actually making elephant's toothpaste. We're doing a classic chemistry demonstration, which is called elephant's toothpaste. All oh, right. So why do they call it elephant's toothpaste? Then? Ah, you'll see in just a minute, all right? So Goodbye, let's get going. Rocco. Yeah, I don't see really Rocco. have you. OK. Sorry. Well, let's okay. get this thing set up. So here goes some hydrogen peroxide into my big graduated cylinder. Mm -hmm. About 50 millilitres of that stuff. Yeah. Cool. Looks a lot like water, right? Yep. Maybe a little bit more. There we go. Mm. Now, we're going to add a little bit of detergent to this. OK. And that should make it nice and soapy. Yep, 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 yep. OK. OK. Now, at the moment, it's not doing much. Yeah, there yeah. is a very slow chemical reaction going on in there, but we're going to speed it all up with our catalyst. Ah. ah you, uh, now, do you know what a catalyst is? Um, a person who works with cats. No. Uh, a cat's shopping list. Uh, no. Um, a program on the ABC. Uh, yeah, right, yeah. Uh, a catalyst is a uh, chemical which initiates a chemical reaction, and this mm. one does a really good job in here. So, are you ready to see it yeah, happen? Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, so, what, where do you put it in? Um, uh, I'm just going to pour it in. OK, OK, OK. All right. right. Here we ready? go. Here we go. One, here. two, three. And... Whoa! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> oh, that is wicked! <laughs> it's like a big, frothy tube. I know! I don't know why they call it elephant's toothpaste. It looks like someone had just squeezed a tube of elephant's toothpaste. It's oh, fantastic. wow! How did that happen? Well, I'm really glad you asked, Elliot. Um, hydrogen peroxide slowly breaks down into just water mm -hmm. and oxygen, which is a gas. Yeah. Our catalyst here, potassium iodide, makes that reaction happen really fast. <gasps> and the detergent traps our little bubbles and makes them last much longer, so it turns into this beautiful foamy stuff. Oh, oh it's warm. Yes, it's very really warm. warm. That's a byproduct of the reaction. It's an exothermic reaction which makes it very, very warm. It releases heat. Wow! You know what? I want to do this again. Can we do this again? Yeah, but we're going to have to clean this up first. Oh, OK. You know what this calls for? What's that? TV magic! Oh. Ah! <laughs> and that was one of my tricks. And I'm not going to tell you how I do that. I like it. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty good. OK, what are we doing? We're doing it again. All right, All right. we're going to do it again, but this time we're going to add a little bit of food colouring to each one so that we get a beautiful colours as it comes out. Ah! All right. Okay. So, add a little, bit of red to yours. A little bit of honest, really good. Yeah, we'll put some green in here. I really want it to be red. Uh -huh. I want it to go faster. Okay. <laughs> All right, now you've got your catalyst over there ready to go. Yeah. Potassium iodide. And okay. on the count of three, shall we do it? Yeah, yeah. One, two, two three. three. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> it's like a big colourful bubble bath. Sorry, I'm just getting caught up in the experiment. Have fun. This is fantastic. You know what I've learnt? What have you learnt? I've learnt that if you've ever had your hair bleached, do not let a cat sit on your head or your head will turn into toothpaste. Hmm, interesting. Well, I'll see you next time. OK. In the bubble. Oh, the surfing scientist is so clever. You can find him by the Spark section of rollercoaster.com.au. See you soon.